and this is our live show. I'm glad to have you back. So today we're talking with Jenny Meyer from uh, Smitter Townhomes. We're really happy to have you on the show. Uh, so I guess by starting off, tell us a little bit about Smetter. Um, yeah, so um, I started working with Smetter Homes about three and a half years ago. Mm -hmm. um, Sean Smetter, the builder, he started building houses around 17 years ago. Mm -hmm. So he's built 700 plus homes over the years. Um, tons of experience there and he's always been all about quality. Mm -hmm. um, he always offers the most superior product, granite countertops, um, you know, wood floors, high-end lighting, things like that. So that's one thing that he's really taken pride in um, over the years. Sure. And, um, he's gained a really great reputation for a builder. Um, everyone has seen his homes and has been in his homes. So nice. um, just really great product um, that he takes uh, lots of pride in, and so do I. So um, we've got three townhome developments right now that he's working on. Um, well, one's coming next year. Two of them are in process right now. Okay, very, very cool. So um, what has been some of your, on a personal level, what have been some of your influences or business influences or... Uh, real estate influences or things like that? Yeah, um, probably my dad has been one of my biggest influences. Um, nice. I'm a lot like him. He's always been a super hard worker, um, strong work ethic, great with people, people person. Um, and that was kind of instilled in me from very, very young childhood. Sure. Um, which is probably why I started working when I was 15. I got my first job at Amigos. <laughs> <laughs> so, so no, I, I, I work a lot as well. So he was a huge influence. Um, my husband, Evan, awesome guy. Mm -hmm. He's very supportive and supports my business fully. Mm -hmm. He's, he's there to kind of help me, you know, when there's rough days and, you know, good <laughs> sure. moments and everything. Um, my brokers, Thane and Arla, mm -hmm. um, they're amazing also. So mm -hmm. they're always, always there for support and feedback and nice. and help if we need it. So um, they're really great brokers to work for too. That's awesome. Yeah, we see Spinner signs in all over town, so we're always happy to see that. Yeah, um, yeah, it's exciting to see all those signs. <laughs> yeah. Also, I love Amigos, so that sounds good too. <laughs> I know, right? All my friends were working there, and so um, I thought, well, gosh, I need to get a job now too, and I want to work with my friends, and they <laughs> were hiring at 15. So <laughs> that's how I got my job here. So I don't blame you. I want to work with my friends. Yeah, <laughs> so, exactly. Same thing. I wish we made tacos, but unfortunately, we... <laughs> I know. I might Just have amigos time. for lunch today. Actually, it's a good idea. <laughs> so you put it in my head too. Everyone buy amigos. <laughs> <laughs> we don't. Have, it's a free plug. So there you go. <laughs> so um, so um, what, what do you think has been the biggest key to Smetter's success? Uh, what's been the best uh, driving influence for for your business? Um, for Smetter, um, the quality and the longevity, um, just his, his reputation of being around so long, mm -hmm. um, you know, and I try to represent him in the utmost, um, you know, respectful manner that I can um, sure. with his product and just the way that we treat other agents and the clients and things like that. So mm -hmm. we want to make sure everyone has um, a really great experience when they're purchasing um, a townhome. Sure. So just, just kind of treating people right and offering a good product. That's great. That's mm -hmm. great. We try to do the same thing as well. Mm -hmm. um, how is, um, by the way, we love, check, make sure to check out this mask. This is super great. Uh, um, <laughs> it keeps uh, falling down, but a <laughs> <yeah. laughs> realtor plug and I love friends. It's seriously <laughs> one of my favorite shows of all time. I was going to say, so. it's just, it works on two levels. So I love it. Yeah. <laughs> um, so speaking of, speaking of masks, um, how has Smetter done during COVID and what have been some, some good coping strategies for during the pandemic? Actually, we have sold a lot of townhomes during the pandemic. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah, yeah. We were just talking about it last night, how fortunate we have been mm -hmm. to have stayed busy during this because I know a lot of businesses have not. Sure. Um, but, you know, people need houses still. Inventory is low. Mm -hmm. um, you know, new builds are very attractive to people. Um, get to pick out some of your own stuff and, you know, it's all brand new. So Absolutely. we've actually stayed pretty busy. This is our second best year um, oh, working wow. together with townhomes that's um, great to hear. in the last three and a half years. So that's amazing. we've been really fortunate. We feel really blessed. Yeah, that's that's great. I yeah. say that a lot of businesses are struggling, so it's great when they do well. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, so what do you think sets you apart from your, your competitors? What, uh, what makes Smetter a better option for people seeking, a, seeking their first home or another town home? Um, value, value. Sure. Um, I'm all about offering value um, as a realtor, as a team leader, um, and as a representative of my builder, my builder himself. 
um, value and quality. I think mm -hmm. people can really tell when there's a good product in front of them. You can just tell the difference when you walk in his house, his houses, and um, you know, just value quality. Absolutely, probably the top two things. Yeah, let's mm -hmm. say that's really important. Um, so, if you could describe a little bit of the work that we at True North did for your website and how that's how that's helped you, both both during COVID and and after. Sure, <laughs> sure. So, um, his website was pretty outdated, <laughs> and so. <laughs> I thought, let's just start over from scratch, and I met Renee, and mm -hmm. she had a great um, business plan. I liked her immediately, and um, she has some good ideas as well. Mm -hmm. So I thought, let's get a website, just brand new, start from fresh, from scratch. And so um, Dylan and Jen were awesome to work with, um, like answered all my questions, built a really quality, beautiful, aesthetically pleasing website, mm -hmm. um, user-friendly. It's a really great site that brings people um, back to me for questions. Mm -hmm. um, contact me is like all over the website, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. um, and I have gotten a lot of inquiries from people that are on the site with just questions about the townhomes and, and the builder and whatnot. That's great. That's yeah. really good to hear. Yeah. Like we, we really take pride in websites and we love making them. And um, I was very happy. I joined a little bit after this was created, so I just loved looking at it too. It's and, beautiful. Yeah, Dylan does a great job. Yeah. Dylan, Dylan's our web guy. He's amazing. So even I, I was like, saw it the first time, I was amazed. I just thought it looked great. Yeah, the so. builder also agrees. Um, we both just gush about it. It's, <laughs> it's, it looks great, and they've been great to work with, too. So Good, good. Um, so what's, so kind of speaking to that a little bit, what's been your favorite part of Smitter Homes and your favorite part of working, kind of working in the real estate field? Um, real estate in general, I like helping people. I like nice. meeting new people. Um, mm -hmm. You're literally meeting people every single day. Um, you're helping them achieve their dream of home ownership. Um, no day is the same, so you're dealing with like air conditioners one day and like deeds of trust another day. So um, never a dull moment, which I really like. It's a lot of problem solving, which is fun too, and and, and kind of some counseling sometimes. You know, you're, <laughs> you're you know you're being a, a good listening ear for your clients and guiding them in the, in the right direction as well as um, as well as um, you know providing the service to them and, and representing them. Um, so since representing this builder, Sean Smetter, I've gained a love of new construction. Um, yeah, I love it. I absolutely love it. I kind of feel like that's one of my niches now. Um, just learning the process and learning about the products. Um, you know, I get to meet all of his subcontractors and I'm at the job site, you know, kind of taking it all in and just kind of learning as much as I can. So that's, yeah, that's I've awesome. Gained a love of new construction. Absolutely. That's super. <laughs> I've always been really interested. I just don't know anything about it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, there's a lot to it, but, mm -hmm. um, I really, really enjoy it. And I've got some great agents that, um, are on my townhome teams. Mm -hmm. And so they've been learning a lot about it too, and, and been able to help their clients with, with new construction too. That's great. That's super cool. Yeah. Um, so what are some of your future goals? Uh, I, I guess I guess this uh, goals for Smetter and personal goals for you as well. Um, personal goal wise, um, I co-own a team with Matt Mick, um, Lincoln Select Real Estate Group. Very nice. And we currently have around 20 people on our team and our goal is to keep growing. Um, mm -hmm. We want to add five more full-time agents um, here in the next six months mm -hmm. and probably add another transaction coordinator, um, another um, media marketing director. So and we're mm -hmm. looking to definitely grow and expand. Um, and same with the Smetter townhomes. Mm -hmm. We've got our two developments now, um, another one starting next year. Um, hopefully we can, you know, land is very hard to come by. So <laughs> it's pretty much Certainly. about finding the land um, mm -hmm. that would su be suitable for a, a development. Mm -hmm. But I would love to get more developments going with him um, down the road too. Absolutely. Yeah. So we wish we had land to sell. We don't have any. <laughs> I know. <laughs> That's true it's North, hard true to find. Thing is land, I'm sure. <laughs> is there any farmers out there that want to sell some ground? Because <laughs> <laughs> we're we not can, above begging. We can help with that. <laughs> <laughs> we need land. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, so speaking that a little bit. So what's been um, Smetter's overall digital strategy or uh, what, what works best uh, from a digital strategy point of view for real estate these days? Um, I can also talk about that a little bit too if you yeah. want. So it's up to you. Yeah. <laughs> um, I would say social media is huge, 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 huge. Sure. Um, Smetter Homes did not have a Facebook or Instagram page um, until I came into the picture. And so 
um, created those a few years back and obviously trying to get as much engagement um, posting on those pages. But mm -hmm. I mean, everyone's on social media these days. Absolutely. Everyone. I mm -hmm. mean, that's where you go. Um, you're scrolling through, you, you know, you see a pretty townhouse, you, you know, click on it. Um, I've been doing some boosted posts also, Very nice. so try to reach a bigger audience that way as well. So a lot of social media. Yeah, let's say that tends to be our, <clears throat> we've discovered that a lot too, doing social media for businesses, especially, especially during COVID. That's been a huge thing. Just mm -hmm. so many businesses, you know, if the marketing mix has changed a little bit, it used to be focused on radio and TV and that kind of stuff. And now we do a little bit of that, but our biggest focus has been digital and just websites and yes. organic discovery is mm -hmm. wonderful helps people find things. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, so what's been, so what are some uh, new developments going on with Smetter? Um, anything, anything new or anything, any updates or changes maybe? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so um, we currently have our Wilderness Creek townhome development um, just mm -hmm. south of Lexus. So over by 37th and Yankee Hill. Mm -hmm. We've got nine left over there. So that one's um, probably going to be finished up early next year. Mm -hmm. And we have one currently starting um, Waterford Estates up on like 103rd and O, just north of that nice. um, street. And we'll have 80, 80 townhomes in there, I believe. Nice. So the first building is in foundation stage with completion in the spring. Mm -hmm. So um, that's super exciting. We've been waiting for that development for a long time. Um, so glad that's finally <laughs> getting going. Um, and then we have another one coming next year mm -hmm. called Wilderness Hills. Okay. And that one's by 27th and Rokeby. Um, and that'll be 132 townhomes. So that's a huge, huge <laughs> development. Um, just very exciting all around. <laughs> you guys are staying busy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it keeps me busy, but yeah. I love it. So, and I've got a lot of help from my, my team members too. So. That's, that's awesome. Yeah. Um, so when not doing uh, real estate, when not doing smenter and business, what do you like to do? Like, what do you listen to? What are some hobbies for you? Um, my husband and I uh, like to travel. Um, mm -hmm. We are beach bums. <laughs> <laughs> I'm we, with you on that. <laughs> we love the ocean. We love the sun. Obviously, mm -hmm. it's really hard right now to do the traveling piece of things, but mm -hmm. um, but we do go to Florida a few times a year. So we traveling is probably our biggest our biggest thing that we love to do when we can just get get together with friends and yeah. just have you know um, dinner, go to vineyards, things like that, live music. So that's awesome. Um, which is also hard to do right now too. So <laughs> I would think we've been watching a lot of Netflix lately. <laughs> what have you been watching? What's good? <laughs> um, we just watched Queen's Gambit. Oh, okay. everybody's talking about that. It's Very so good. popular right now. Mm -hmm. Very good. Been working on scan or uh, not scandal. Um, how to get away with murder. Um, been working nice. on that one for a few months. So. But, yeah. Sounds exciting. I know, right? <laughs> I need to. I say I need to watch Queen's Gambit. Everybody I know on my Facebook is just blowing up with that show. It's it looks really, it looks really good. I it's, it. Yeah, it was great, and we got through it in like like a whole like a Sunday. So it wasn't like <laughs> drawn out. Like, Definitely bingeable. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Absolutely. Awesome. Well, this has been great. Loved having you on. Uh, everyone, use a Smetter Townhome. Buy them. They're building more, so you need to buy them. Yes. If you have land, call her. <laughs> yes, land so. or buyers or anyone interested in townhomes at all, let me know. <laughs> or call Tree North, we'll put, put you in touch with her so you can sell your land. <laughs> so uh, thank you so much for tuning in, and next week we'll have a, another great guest, so I hope you tune in to check it out. Thank you, Jenny. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. <laughs>